Welcome back to Ruby Volume 2, Chapter 1. But before we get into that, thank you so much for the immense support in Volume 1. Wow, what a ride it has been. The finale, did y'all see the finale? Insane, right? I told you about Penny. I told you she was an android. It's just like certain vibes I can pick up on. But anyway, one thing before we get into Chapter 1. So... A lot of people in the comment section, thank you by the way, have wanted me to react to the volume one soundtrack. I did not anticipate that it was gonna be 20 plus songs for me to react to, and it's two plus hours of material. I've made the decision to not have it edited the way that these videos have been. Instead, I'm going to do a live stream of it. It's just better for my mental to do like that. Two hours of footage to edit the way that I want to, scares me and i don't want to you know like bring down the quality of it so we're gonna do a live stream of it when tomorrow we can do it tomorrow i'm gonna live stream on this channel as well as twitch if you want the twitch lid you know what it is the time i'm gonna roughly do it around the same time let's aim for noon central we're gonna be trying to do that and react to the volume one soundtrack that's the best i can do because i don't want to not do it so that's the best alternative. Also, stick to the end of this video. Another small bit of news that I think y'all would like to. Anyway, voice crack. Let's get into volume two. I'm excited for this already. Chapter one. Nope, no intro. There, there's no in, okay. That's fine. I thought it was gonna be an intro, that's fine. <laughs> Dust or not. Oh my god! Excuse me. Sorry. <laughs> Who is this? around here. Who is this? Um, would you mind pointing me in the direction of the shop? Mm -hmm. Oh, he like him some caramel vanilla and then Ah, I tried to make a joke and it was horrible. I meant to say caramel macchiato. Who is this? I knew you were lost. Mercury, I wait. That's the dude, these are the two people in the finale. Whoa, I'll seriously, pay you to shut up. That's <laughs> not your money, but it could be yours for five minutes of silence. Mm, no deal. Mm, fine, whatever you want me. <laughs> what? What? Everyone's not a shadow person. So That's how cool. much farther? A few blocks. Oh, this place is so dull. Meh, I kind of like it. Tall buildings, diverse culture. And nice dopey people who are easy to pickpocket. That's oh every my city. Ooh, Emerald, Master Thief. Please don't take my money. I barely... Is his name Emerald? No. Is that what he said? We have enough to get by. Mm. <sighs> what is no her fun name? today? I like this already. Welcome to Tuxin's Book Trade, home to every book under the sun. Every book. How may I... Uh, how may I help you? Carmel Just Macchiato. browsing. Actually, I was wondering, do you have any copies of The Thief and the Butcher? Yes, we do. Mint That's chocolate. great. Would you like a copy? No. Just wondering. The oh, oh. What about Violet's Garden in paperback? He's got it. Hardback, too. Ooh, options are nice. Eh, no pictures. Hey, why is he smacking this book like that? <laughs> Who smacks a book like... I ain't gonna lie, it, it is pretty fun. Do you have any comics? Near the front. Oh, no, wait. What about Third Crusade? Um... I what does mean? What does mean? Don't what does believe mean? we carry that one. Uh, again what I got the hiccups now. Damn. Oh. What was this place called again? Tuxin's Book Trade. And you're Tuxin? That's right. 
So then I take it that you're the one who came up with the catchphrase. Yes. And what was it again? <sighs> every book Tuxin's under the sun. book trade, home to every book under the sun. Uh -oh. Except the Third Crusade. Uh oh. It's just a catchphrase. It's false advertising. You shouldn't make a promise you can't keep. Whoa! I hear you're planning on leaving. Moving all the way to Vacuo. Your brothers in the White Fang wouldn't be happy to hear that. Whoa! Whoa! What's happening? And neither are we. You know who we are, don't you? Yes. And you know why we're here? Yes. Oh, snap! Oh, snap! What's about to happen, y'all? Are you going to fight back? Yes! Whoa! Huh? Oh, damn! Damn! Did they kill him? Did they get their book? I like the pictures. So nonchalant, y'all just bodied somebody. And who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? I don't know who that is. <gasps> Blake. What you doing? Nothing. Just going over notes from last semester. <laughs> Lame. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ruby. <clears throat> Sisters. Friends. Wife. Is this person eating a whole watermelon? Weiss. Hey. Four score and seven minutes ago, I <laughs> had a dream. This ought to be good. <laughs> mm. A dream that one day, the four of us would come together as a team and have the most fun anyone has ever had. Ever! Did ever! You my binder? I am not a crook. What are you talking about? The really the Richard Nixon reference? Come on. Stop the semester with a bang. I always kick my semesters off with a yang. Ah. Am okay. I right? I'll go. <laughs> Look through a whole app. I'm sorry, but this is great. It's been a good two weeks, and between more exchange students arriving and the tournament at the end of the year, our second semester is going to be great. But classes start back up tomorrow. Which is why I've taken the time to schedule a series of wonderful events for us today. I don't Her know hair is long. Proud or scared of what you have in store? <laughs> I don't know. I think I might sit this one out. Sit out or not, I think however we spend this last day, we should do it as a team. I, for one, think that. Oh! <laughs> no, Nora. No, it was red. It was red. Man, that's harsh. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, this is just a personal preference. I know people are gonna shout at me in the comments. I kind of like how there were shadow characters instead of everyone being animated. Don't get me wrong. It's a nice touch. It's great. But I feel like with there being shadow people, you can really focus on the people you should be focusing on. Because now I'm looking at everybody. And now I'm overstimulated. Anybody else feel the same way that I do? No? That's fine. Then we were fighting side by side. And she was super fast. And I threw a banana at a guy, which sounds gross, but it was awesome. Nice. Right? And the best part is, she's a faunus. But that's a secret, okay? Wait, wait. Not no. And not a, I'm gonna go tell Scarlet the second son turns his back seat. Is this ninja? I'm talking secret, secret. Whoa, chill out, man, okay? I got it. I got it. You better. I just don't want to screw this up, you know? The people here are the coolest. No offense to you guys. I'm taken. Okay, they're just in here. <laughs> I'm really excited for you to meet them. So be cool, okay? You're gonna be cool, right? Dude. Stop it. Stop it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh 
I'm done! I'm done! Woo! I spit all over my monitor. Spice, spice, don't leave me! No! Oh my! I get it. The food is our weapons, like. guys and they were standing there the whole time oh snap batty alert where did that come from children please do not play with your food <laughs> Let it go. <sighs> Why do I feel like Professor Osbin is not all that I know him as? Why well, I feel like he got like a hidden You know every show has it. But anyway, let me let me talk about it. Let me not Ooh, y'all are screaming at me. They're supposed to be the defenders of the world. And they will be. But right now they're still children. So why not let them play the part? After all, all, it isn't a role they'll have forever. What, to be children? Or... Is his name Emerald? What's her name? Did they say it and I wasn't paying attention? Ooh, white Fang, White Fang, y'all. Oh, oh my God. Look, Fabio! She sent the kids again. Roman. This is turning out just like the divorce. Bro! He has his whole hand over his... Over her head! Oh, spare us the thought of you procreating. That was a joke. And this... I <laughs> got him. Just might. Tell me where you two have been all day. What? <sighs> I'm a professional, sweetheart. Pay attention. Maybe you'll learn something. Damn. Why do you have this address? Wouldn't Big you pocket. like to know? Yeah, I would. Now, where have you been all day? Cleaning up your problems. Mm. One of them, at least. I had that under control. Two packed bags and a ticket out of bail said otherwise. Listen, you little punk. If it were up to me, I would take you and your little street rat friend here, and I would... Uh oh Batty alert! <laughs> I'd, uh, not kill them? Cinder! I thought I made it clear that you were to eliminate the would-be runaway. I was going to... He was going to escape to Vacuo. Mercury and I decided to take it upon ourselves to kill the rat. I think he was some sort of cat, actually. What? Like a puma? Yeah, there you go. Quiet. Oh, Did I not specifically instruct you two to keep your hands mm -hmm. clean while in Veil? <laughs> I just thought... Don't think. <laughs> Obey. 
Yes, ma'am. Yes. It won't happen again. And you. Uh -oh. <laughs> Why wasn't this job done sooner? Uh. Huh? Uh? 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 Sorry if I've been a little busy stealing every speck of dust in the kingdom. You're an inspiration to every punk with a gun and a ski mask. Oh! Around here, they've got this town running scared. Police camping out at every corner, dust prices through the roof, and. We're sitting pretty in an old warehouse with more dust crystals, vials, and rounds than we know what to do with. Speaking of which, if you guys wouldn't mind filling me in on your Grandmaster plan, it might actually make my next string of robberies go a little smoother. Oh, Roman, have a little faith. You'll know what you need when you need to know it. <sighs> Besides, we're done with dust. What was that? Okay, then what now? We're moving. Have the White Fang clear out this building. I'll send you details and coordinates tonight. Coordinates? We're proceeding to phase two. <laughs> this show is too good. I can't. Chapter There's a point where it tips, there's Whoa. a point where it breaks, there's a point where it bends, and a point we just can't take anymore. <laughs> Chapter 18, welcome to Beacon. I'm still recording, right? Beautiful. Beacon? What is this? What am I looking at? Is this that one tower we keep seeing at night? Ironwood certainly loves bringing his work wherever he travels. Oh? Well, running an academy and a military makes him a busy man. But yes, those are a bit of an eyesore. Hmm. A Come military? In. Ozpin! Hello, General. Please, drop the formalities. They have their own military? <laughs> it's been too long. And Glinda, it has certainly been too long since we last met. Whoa. Oh, James. I'll be outside. Oh! Well, she hasn't changed a bit. Oh, uh, that's because she's with me, I mean. So, what in the world has brought you all the way down from the Atlas? Headmasters don't typically travel with their students for the Vital Festival? Well, you know how much I love Vale this time of year. Isn't Weiss from Atlas? Besides, with you hosting, I thought this might be a good opportunity for us to catch up. I can certainly appreciate quality time between friends. However, a small fleet outside my window has me somewhat concerned. Mm. Oh, that's Well, his concern is what brought them here. I understand travel between kingdoms has become increasingly difficult. <clears throat> Oz, you and I both know why I brought those men. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on, y'all? We're in a time of peace. Shows of power like this are just going to give off the wrong impression. But if what Crow said is true, then... If what Crow said is true, then we will handle it tactfully. It's the Vital Festival. A time to celebrate unity and peace. So I suggest you not scare people by transporting hundreds of soldiers halfway across the continent. I'm just being cautious. As am I. Which is why we will continue to train the best huntsmen and huntresses we can. Believe me, I am. Mm. Mm. Ask yourself this. Do you honestly believe your children can win a war? Uh-oh. Uh-oh! I hope they never have to. Interesting! Alright. What y'all playing? Yu-Gi-Oh? Right. Uno? Oh, she got a drop. Prepare your kingdom for battle! Bring she it got, on! She I got a drop for The Elysian Air Fleet! <gasps> Looks like I get to fly right over your Ursi and attack your wolf directly! <gasps> you fiend! And since Atlas is part of Mantle, my repair time only lasts one turn. <laughs> <laughs> 
pretty sneaky, sis. Uh oh. But you just activated my trap card. Trap card, damn it! Never more. If I roll a seven or higher, Fatal Feathers will slice your fleet in two. But if you roll a six or lower, the Nevermore will turn on your own forces. That's just a chance I'm willing to take. Haha! -ha! But I also have the magic card, Pot of Greed. This card allows me. I'm not gonna do it, I'm sorry. X ray what? X ray bay? Oh, hey. Can you just put the page over? You all have pancakes. No. Well, Weiss, it's your turn. I have absolutely no idea what's going on. Yay! Look, it's easy. You're playing as Vacuo, which means all Vacuo-based cards come with a bonus. Why that is sounds Ruby dumb. Cried See, over you've there. got Sandstorm, Desert Scavenge. Oh, oh, Resourceful Raider. See, now you could take Ruby's discard air fleet Duh. and put it in your hand. Okay. And since Vacuo Warriors have an endurance boost against natural hazards, you could use Sandstorm to disable my ground forces and simultaneously infiltrate my kingdom. Just know that I will not forget this declaration of war. And that means... You're just three moves away from conquering Remnant! <laughs> oh god! Yes! No! Fear the almighty power of my nope. forces. No. Nope. Power as they pillage your homes and weep as they take your children from your very arms. Trap card. Huh? Trap your card. Your armies have been destroyed. I hate this game of emotions we play. These oh my god, why did that hit so deep? I Alright, Blake, you're up. Huh? Oh, um, sorry, what am I doing? You're playing as Vale, trying to conquer the kingdoms of Remnant. Right. Hey, can I play? Sorry, Jean, we've already got four people. Besides, this game requires a certain level of tactical cunning that I seriously doubt you possess. Damn! Uh, you attacked your own naval fleet two turns ago. Hmm. Bring it on, Ice Queen. I'll have you know that I've been told I'm a natural-born leader. By who? Your mother? And Pyrrha. Hello again. Come on, let me play your hand for a turn. I'm not trusting you with the good citizens of Vacuo. Why not? You've trusted me with way more important stuff before. I mean, you told us all that Blake is secretly a fun-loving person whom we all admire and respect. <laughs> you told them! You told them! Oh, no! Deceit! That. Ladies? Enjoy your battle. Wow! Hey, wow. son. Ruby, Yang, Blake, son, Ice Queen. What is everything? His name is Son. That's why. Okay, I thought Blake was being smart or funny in that one episode. Ice Queen. Why does everyone keep calling me that? Because he's cold as ice. I never got a chance to formally introduce you to my old friend. Uh, aren't libraries for reading? Thank you. Pancakes! <gasps> Shut up. Don't be a nerd. G -g 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 -g. Intellectual, okay? Thank you. I'm Neptune. So, Neptune. Neptune. Where are you from? Haven. And I don't believe I've caught your name, oh Snow my Angel. Gosh. Um, I'm Weiss. Are you kidding me? Pleasure to meet you. I never took you as the board game playing type. Right. Well, I think I'm done playing, actually. I'll see you guys later. Women. Nora! <laughs> <laughs> Nora, okay. so much. Going in on a joint business venture together. <laughs> well, this has certainly been an eventful evening. Hmm. I'm sure that after a night of thwarting attempted robbery, you probably just want to go home and take a nap. But I was hoping that maybe we could have a chance to talk. Of course. Wonderful. As you know, in order to enroll at my academy, Students uh, must first pass a rigorous entrance exam. Uh, Most applicants spend years of preparation training at one of the many combat schools around the world. You are one of the few who did not. And you passed the exam with flying colors. I was raised outside the kingdoms. If you can't fight, you can't survive. Well, you have most certainly survived, Blake. I admire your drive. And I am proud to run a school that accepts individuals from all walks of life. Rich. Poor, human, faunus. Why do you wear that bow, Blake? Why hide who you are? You may be willing to accept the faunus, Professor Ospin, but your species is not. True. 
But we are continuing to take strides to lessen the divide. With all due respect, you need to start taking some larger strides. Until then, I'd rather avoid any unnecessary attention. I want people to see me for who I am, not what I am. And what are you? I... I don't understand what you're asking. How did you know the White Fang would be at the shipyard tonight? I didn't. I just happened to be at the right place at the right time. You wouldn't have been the first. But what happened tonight was not an isolated incident. I may be your headmaster, but I am also a huntsman. And it is my sworn duty to protect this world from the forces that conspire against it. Blake, are you sure there is nothing else you would like to tell me? I'm sure. Blake. Very well. Thank you for your time, Ms. Belladonna. If you ever need to talk to me, please don't hesitate to ask. Mm. Ugh, we should have never let him play. <laughs> You're just mad because the new guy beat you. See, if you had just attacked when I hey, told you, what? none of this would have happened. Stop. Lately, you've been quiet, antisocial, and moody. Uh, have you met Blake? Which I get is kind of your thing, but you've been doing it more than usual, which, quite frankly, is unacceptable. You made a promise to me, to all of us, that you would let us know if something was wrong. So, Blake Belladonna, what is wrong? <laughs> Okay, Weiss. Also, I again for the pausing, a lot of you in the comments, I love all of you dearly. You have to understand why I had a hard time, or I have a hard time saying Weiss, and I'm saying Weiss. It's because I'm a big Dragon Ball fan, Dragon Ball super fan, and there's Weiss. I love that guy. So Weiss and Weiss, I'm trying to get it right. Thank you for being patient. I just love Dragon Ball. I just... I don't understand how everyone can be so calm. You're still thinking about Torchwick? Torchwick? The White Fang? All of it. Something big is happening and no one is doing anything about it. Ospin told us not to worry. Between the police and the Huntsmen, I'm sure they could handle it. Well, I'm not! They don't know the White Fang like I do. Okay, between blowing up nightclubs, stopping thieves, and fighting for freedom, I'm sure the three of you think you're all ready to go out and apprehend these ne'er-do-wells. Uh, who? But let me once again be the voice of reason. We're students. We're not ready to handle this sort of situation. Well, yeah, but... <laughs> We're not ready. And we may never be ready. Our enemies aren't just gonna sit around and wait for graduation day. They're out there somewhere planning their next move and none of us know what it is, but it's coming. Whether you know. we're ready or not. Okay. All in favor of becoming the youngest hunter says to single-handedly bring down a corrupt organization conspiring against the kingdom of Vale. Say I. Yes! That's I love it when you're feisty. Well, I suppose it could be fun. None of you said I. All right. That's then. what I'm saying. We're in this together. Let's hatch a plan. Yeah! <gasps> I left my board game in the library. We're doomed. <laughs> okay, Who are you running to, oh, Penny? Sorry. Is it Penny? Are, are you okay? I'm <gasps> fine. Just watch where you're going. You gotta be kidding me! Oh, <laughs> right. Sorry. Um, I'm Ruby. Are you new? Visiting from Haven, actually. Ooh, you're here for the festival. Oh, but exchange students have their own dormitory. I guess we just got turned around. <laughs> Don't worry, happens all the time. Uh, your building is just east of here. Thanks. Maybe we'll see you around. Yeah, maybe. Oh, uh, and welcome to Beacon! No! No! Chapter 19, a minor hiccup. Whoa, y'all. This is insane. So, Weiss, you know, uh, I was thinking after this, maybe we could go grab a bite to eat. And, uh, 
you know, well, I I've got two tickets to that new Spruce Willis movie if you want to make the trip to Vale. I hear it's awesome. Don't you have Pyra? Vera? Sorry, then Vera. Maybe after that we could study together? John, I'm sorry, young sir, but please take the hit. She's not interested. Go home. I mean, you're smart, and I'm a, you know. And then I, oh, uh, timed that one wrong, I guess. Well, the stunning conclusion to the story will have to wait until next time. On Dragon Weiss? Ball Z. Did you hear me? No, 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 yes. Uh, oh. One day. <laughs> Don't you have Hero? I thought that class would never end. All right, guys, today is the day. New attire. Investigation begins. I'm glad to see we're taking this so seriously. Hey, we've got a plan. That's moderately serious. Right. Everyone remember their roles? You and I will head to the CCT to check the Schnee records for any other dust robberies or inconsistencies. Seeing as I'm in the family, it shouldn't be a problem. The White Fang has regular faction meetings to hand out orders and recruit new members. If I can get in, I can hopefully find out what they're planning. I have an old friend on the shady side of town that typically knows everything going on in Vale. Getting information out of him shouldn't be too hard. Great, we'll meet up tonight near Yang to go over what we found. Let's do this! Yeah! Son! Son! How did you get up there? Ah, uh, it's easy. I do it all the time. You do what? I climb trees all the time. Oh! So, are we finally getting back at that Torchwick guy? We are going to investigate the situation as a team. Sorry, son. We don't want to get friends involved if we don't have to. Pfft, that's dumb. You should always get friends involved. That's why I brought Neptune. What? What's up? How did you even get up here? I have my ways. That's creepy. Seriously, though, can I come in? We're, like, really high up right now. All right. I'll go with Weiss. Son, you can go with Blake. And Neptune, you can go with Yang since she doesn't have a partner. Everyone good? Actually, Ruby, why don't you go with Yang? <laughs> After all, she is your sister. But I say we'd go with you then. Well, I guess Neptune could come with me. <laughs> nah. But, but! Whoa! Whoa! Why's got a thing for Neptune? Don't you forget how big the transmit tower looks up close? You should see the one in Atlas. That was the first one, right? Correct. Atlas developed the cross-continental transmit system to allow the four kingdoms to communicate with one another. It was their gift to the world after the Great War. Ooh, look at me. My name is Weiss. I know facts. I'm rich. <coughs> Got him. Don't be a pest. Besides, the only reason we're here is because you like the tower so much. We could have just as easily made a call from the library. I know, but it's so cool. Oh, I'm going to take a picture. Ah. Oh. Penny! You dropped this. Penny? Uh, where have you been? We haven't seen you since the night at the docks. S sorry, I think you're confused. <gasps> uh, I've got to go. Pick up. What was that about? I don't know, but I'm going to find out. You go make your call. I'll meet up with you later. Wait. <sighs> hmm. Penny, where have you been? It's been weeks. There seems to be a misunderstanding. What? Penny. Is everything okay? Penny, please stop. Look, I don't know what's wrong, but you have to listen to me. Those guys we fought at the docks, we think they're up to something big, something bad. I need you to tell me what happened to you that night. Please, as a friend. <sighs> Is the real penny? It isn't safe to talk here. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. I'm like, out in the open, Ruby? What? But you know whoever, like, Penny's overseer is, they're gonna find out. Unless she, like, deactivates something. But no, they would still know that, too. She just walks right in. Welcome to the CCT. How may I help you? I'd like to go to the communications room, please. Absolutely. Could you please place your scroll on the terminal to verify your identity? Perfect. Thank you, Mishni. Mm, 
conflict. Oh man, can you do it? Ooh, what are the symbols? I'm not gonna memorize that right now. Welcome to the Beacon Cross Continental Transmit Center. How may I help you? I need to make a call to Schnee Company World Headquarters in Atlas. Absolutely. If you could head over to Terminal 3, I'll patch you through. Thank you. So far, so good. A little too easy. But you know. Hi, Mom. How are things back in Signal? <sighs> Thank you for calling me, Atlas. Oh, Miss Snee. Good afternoon. Would you like me to patch you through to your father? I think your sister Winter might be here as well. No, thank you. I was actually wondering if you could find some files for me. I've compiled a short list. I see. If you don't mind, what may I ask is this for? School project. Um, there are some sensitive documents on this list, ma'am. Well then, I'll be sure to treat them with care. Right. Very well. Uh -uh. The data's being transferred to your school now. Uh -uh. Wonderful. That will be all then. Uh -uh. Are you sure you wouldn't like me to patch you through to your father before you go? Yes, I'm sure. Well then, have a nice day. You know she's gonna report that back to her dad. This is crazy. She's nervous. I wish I could help you, Ruby. But I don't know anything about those men. Well, what happened to you that night? We were all together and then you just disappeared. Were you kidnapped? Oh no, nothing like that. Well then where did you go? I've never been to another kingdom before. My father asked me not to venture out too far, but oh, you have to understand, my father loves me very much. He just worries a lot. <laughs> Believe me, I know the feeling. But why not let us know you were okay? I was asked not to talk to you, or Weiss, or Blake, or Yang, anybody really. Was your dad that upset? No, it wasn't my father. The AK-130 has been a standard security model of Remnant for several years, and they have done a fine job. Wouldn't you agree? Wouldn't you agree? Oh, boy. But the Kingdom of Atlas is a kingdom of innovation, and fine, well, that's just not good enough, is it? Is that Weiss's father? Presenting the Atlesian Knight. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Smarter, sleeker, oh, gosh. and admittedly, a little less scary. These models will become active later this year, but they won't be alone. Now, the Atlesian military has always supported the idea of removing men from the dangers of the battlefield. Uh -oh. However, there are still many situations that undoubtedly require a human touch. Ruby? So, our kingdom's greatest minds, in cooperation with the Schnee Dust Company, are proud to introduce the Elysian Paladin. Oh, gosh. Hey, how are you? What are you? We're going to have him here for you today. But these mechanized battleships will be seen defending the borders of our kingdom within the year. I don't Ruby? like Ruby? Maybe we should go somewhere else. Yeah. Yeah. Penny? What, what's, what's going Wait, on? Where what's going are you on, going? Penny? Where is she going? Wait, why are they chasing it? Uh oh. Uh oh. Wait a minute. Down here. She went this way. Uh, uh, fuck. Who's in that car? What did that say? Breakable things? This show is too good. This way! <laughs> Whoa! Oh. So is there like, you can only do so much stuff? Let's- Hey! I- <laughs> Are you okay? Uh huh. Oh shoot! You gotta go. You gotta go. You gotta leave. Um. Uh, did you see that? 
Oh no! You gotta. Oh shoot! 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 Gee Willikers, man! No, she didn't. She didn't. You didn't see anything. All of you are hallucinating. Penny! Please! What is going on? Why are you running? How did you do that? I I can't. Everything's fine. I, I don't want to talk about it. Penny, if you can just tell me what's wrong, I can help you. No, no, no. You wouldn't understand. Let me try. You can trust me. You're my friend, right? You promise you're my friend? I promise. Ruby. I'm not a real girl. Pinocchio. Oh. not really like a big reveal that she's not you know a real girl but you know so much new things so many new things are unraveled in volume two why am i having these on the animation did step up a lot the the fighting and everything else stepped up in volume two and it's only volume two there's eight volumes out we got so much to do this has been a ride thus far penny came back in the fray so much more to unravel if you like this video like and comment down below what you thought and you know what here's the second thing that i wanted to bring up first of all live stream tomorrow come through have fun you can stay here on the channel around noon central or you can go on twitch let you know what it is we can chat it up we can listen to the soundtrack of volume one and have a ball uh the second piece of news though tuesdays and fridays come back here tuesday